Hi everybody, just a brief video today for those Civil 3D folks who are currently managing their project data using Vault Professional. In short, we're going to look at a way that we can help drive consistency amongst users such that everyone connecting to the Vault, whether that be with Civil 3D or AutoCAD or MicroStation or some other authoring application, uh, that they'll all use a similar working folder name on their local computer, uh, as opposed to potentially everybody selecting something unique or different uh, location on their computer and then you know trying to figure out which user is using which folder. We want to help drive standards and this is a way that we can enforce a consistent working folder. So let's take a look at what we've got to get started. I'm currently in Civil 3D. I'm in the Civil 3D tool space specifically on the Prospector tab and I'm looking at the master view and if I scroll down I can see that uh, Vault is installed because I've got the projects area that I can work with. I also see that I've got data shortcuts is still available, even though Vault has been installed. I have the ability that I could use one, one technology for leveraging my data references, the other or both. Now, if I've made the transition from data shortcuts to projects to where I don't intend to leverage uh, data references with shortcuts anymore, I also have the ability I could drop that out of the menu by typing in shortcut node. If we just type it in, the autocomplete will automatically finish it for us. And if we set the value to zero, it'll automatically take the shortcuts area out of the prospector. If we determine that we need it again, or legacy project, whatever the case may be, we just set the value to one, that option's uh, back and available for us again. All right, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna right click on projects. I've got two options. I can log into the vault, or I can set a working folder. And like I said, rather than all of my users setting up their own working folder in whatever location on their local drive, or even on a network drive that they like, I'd like to enforce some consistency across the office such that I know that everybody's using a folder called uh, company projects or something like that. So let's do this. To accomplish that, I'm going to flip over to Vault Professional here. This specifically is the Vault Explorer. And uh, with administrative rights, I'm going to go to Tools. I'm going to go to Administration and we'll go to Vault Settings. And we see that there's an option here to define working folder options. We'll go to Define. And we'll come down, and by default, we're allowing clients to define their own working folder. Instead, in our particular case, I'm going to enforce a consistent working folder for everybody. And I can click the ellipsis and drill down and grab that uh, folder on my machine if it exists. If not, I can uh, just take and type that in, and it will automatically be created if it doesn't exist already. So we'll call it uh, Company Projects. Uh, not going to be using Inventor in our particular scenario, just uh, AutoCAD, Civil 3D, MicroStation, and, and other applications like that. We'll say OK. And we'll say OK. Close out of that. From here, we'll flip back to Civil 3D, and it takes place immediately. As soon as my end users start to log back into the vault again, uh, it will immediately uh, establish a working folder that is consistent across all my users. So to see that, I'm going to right-click. We'll log into vault. Uh, we're going to log in as Ed. I currently don't have a password for him, so we'll go ahead and click OK. And when I do, I will see one time that uh, the administrator is enforcing a working folder, and it's been set to the C colon underscore company projects. So once again, if that folder didn't exist on my computer, uh, it will be created. And from this point forward, anything that I do in Civil 3D or AutoCAD or MicroStation or Map or anything that's connecting to the vault, it's automatically going to leverage that company projects, and I can be assured that all of my end users across the organization will be using the, uh, the same structure on their local machines. So once again, whether it comes to uh, troubleshooting or just looking for files or needing to know where something's at in a working folder, I know where everything will be on, on everybody's machine as it relates to uh, when they've checked out files and are working on those in their working folders. So I uh, hope this is helpful, and I look forward to talking to you again soon. See ya.